what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overload here since i'm about halloween ends here today again so james u courtney did a cameo recently where he was wishing someone a happy birthday and he ended it by saying that you know it's kind of hinting that not hinting he did say that the production for halloween ends seems to be starting in february but it was the way he was wording it that has me thinking is the film actually going to start production in february or is james Jude courtney not joining them in the production that's starting this month till february because he used the word i he he states that i was supposed to or something like that referencing the jane the early january start date that i talked about previously in the past before saying that now i again referring to himself i'm not starting till february february 10th to be exact is the date i believe he said so i'm curious are they just going to start production and then there's something that of course we see that they are going to be shooting and based off of what they're shooting he just doesn't need to be there right now so that's why he'll just join them in february i just don't i don't really get it at this point but it could be the other way around maybe they actually are not starting filming in and in in total in february or as a whole i meant to say in february it's just going off his wording i would also just like to throw out the chance that maybe he's talking about the fact that he will not be joining them in filming until february while they still go ahead and start filming this month of january but if they do indeed have delayed it to february whatever the case may be pushed it out a couple weeks the th the thing about it is if they're able to shoot it without any hiccups and go into the post-production very problem free and get everything done and handled and have enough time to i guess market the film over the summer the last two months of the summer i guess or anything mid-summer then they would be fine for their october release date in my opinion halloween 2018 again was shot released same year premiered at tiff debuted 100 percent before of course that trickled down uh overperformed at the box office all of that done within the same year so halloween ends can do it too but that of course would be barring no interruptions and if they get delayed into like March or something like that, if they like if they actually are not going to start filming until February now and not January at all. And let's say that February turns into something else like March or later February, I, I would say we probably should start can start expecting them to maybe not even have the film come out in October. If they are set on just putting the movie out in October, they might push it out to October of 2023. Or if they do indeed just push it out, maybe they'll again just still release it this year, but it's not in the month of October. Since we know we've gotten Halloween movies in the past <laughs> that were not released in the month of October. I'm just considering what they would decide to do. Would they, would they decide to actually wait on it another year and release it in October of 2023? Or would they just go ahead and say, you know what, we'll just not release this October intended movie in October. We'll release it in November or something like that. Who knows? But as far as like the delays, I don't think there's anything we should all be too concerned with because again, Halloween 2018 shot and released in the same year, opened up to a warm reception, overperformed at the box office, and that's why we're at the place that we're in right now with these movies. And you know, it, this has honestly just been one of the better incarnations for Michael Myers. Honestly, this timeline is. Com comprised of the most consistent group of people i would say in terms of the creative process going off of my own memory at this point because i just have a very this i say i just hate the memories that i have just knowing how the other movies were handled where you had just a different team each movie you know you know i'm gonna write this for my halloween five but you know i'm not returning for halloween six i'll leave i'll leave whatever loose ends that i have here for the team that works on halloween six and then you know jumping to halloween h2o which ignores the other movies and then halloween resurrection which is just like the fact that we have some consistency amongst a group of people who seem passionate about what they're doing and have a goal in mind with what they're wanting to do doesn't mean it's going to be executed well on screen but it's just nice to see people start and finish stuff because my biggest gripe or one of my biggest gripes with this franchise is the knowledge of knowing that apparently with halloween 5 they again were writing things not knowing who the man in black was going to be and just left that for someone in halloween 6 to figure out it's just like well, why why are you doing that i i just couldn't fathom doing that for me as a writer if i were writing a movie I, i'm not going to this is just me personally i would not want to write something in a way that is so up in the air that the the people who take on what i've just presented 
here can basically do whatever they want with it and maybe it doesn't even end up making sense to what i was trying to get at or portray on screen in the in the last installment that i worked on with my team so i'm, I'm glad we have some consistency here it's nice to see that there is passion behind all of these films so far everyone seems to be having a good time with each other as far as like the radio tower stuff we'll find out about that when the movie comes out whether or not it ties into his origins or anything like that who knows the fact of the matter is if it ends up factoring into his origins no one is saying that that's a good idea but it's just more of a you know if you do that that does sound to be more accepting than the whole cults of thorn thing and the cult of thorn in and of itself i would say was interesting but again it all comes down to your execution and the way the cult of thorn is executed i would say does not really does not really hold up that well G given all the other things that are left unanswered about it some of the stuff that does not make complete sense some of the stuff that kind of undoes the things that have been established about michael myers in terms of what it's supposed to represent as a character uh or what he's supposed to represent as a character i'm talking about him like he's an object but then again michael Doc, dr loomis would say i was correct in referring to him as an it uh because he he said this isn't a man but the delays whatever might be going on if they start shooting in february that would be the point in time in which we of course should start i guess to start getting cast news because i'm shocked that if they were indeed yes going to start filming in january i think that would be the most convincing thing that maybe they are indeed all going to start filming in february and it's not just james u courtney based off of his word choice the fact that we don't even have any cast announcements so far about these people or any actors or actresses who will be playing the roles of these characters that i talked about in another video that i have i'll have it recommended here at the end of this one that kind of has me convinced that the whole entire production is going to start in february and then of course they could use this month later half of this month start announcing the people that'll be joining them on the new project that will close this trilogy but hopefully we'll get some news soon and have some clarity on the delays but let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below if you haven't already of course make sure you subscribe turn on post notification that you never miss a video in the description i have links to my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course to let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future and with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video